I got this picture in my closet. It's gathering dust right now. And the edges have been folded once or twice. It doesn't look the same no more. Cause the sun has made it pale. I used to have it hanging on my wall some time ago. A picture of you. Hey sweet friends and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Today's video is going to be my son Ryan's bedroom clean with me. I still have to get to his closet but on this day I ran out of time um, doing his bedroom. So I never got around to doing his closet but that will be in a future video. But today I am just cleaning, organizing, decluttering everything his bedroom was so bad it was so so messy and he tried cleaning it up but it just wasn't to my liking so i needed to go in there and just like wipe everything down get rid of a ton of things at a garbage bag full of trash that i got rid of his drawers were just stuffed to the max with like random paper and trash and things that just didn't belong in there so I wanted to come in here and get everything nice and cleaned because Christmas is coming up and he's going to be obviously getting more gifts. So wanted to like declutter his bedroom. We still need to go through his toys and books and see what he wants to donate and get rid of to make room for like his new toys and stuff. But we haven't gotten around to that part yet. So I'm just here cleaning. Like I said, I needed to also dust his room, like his dresser and his fish tank. Everything was just very, very dusty. So that is what today's video is going to be. And then also at the end, we did put up a Christmas tree in his room. It's a really small Christmas tree. He's always had like a little small mini one that I got from Target's dollar spot that just sits on his dresser. But this year I did find a Christmas tree at Dollar Tree in their like new $5 section. And it was only $5 and I think it's about four feet. So really cute Christmas tree. I also bought the lights for it from Dollar Tree. That was also $5. So in total cost, it was $10. And he was so excited when I showed him that he was going to have a Christmas tree in his bedroom. So we did that at the end of the video as well. And then I just decorated a little bit in his room. I needed to get some more Christmas stuff for his bedroom. But for now, he has a little Christmas tree and a pre-lit garland in his room. And he is loving it. So we're going to get into this. We're going to be cleaning, organizing, decluttering. So hopefully you guys enjoy. I'm wondering how many men that you trapped end up in the ocean I wish that I could understand why I had this stupid crush The girl next door was over there being perfect getting the roses I bet that you don't even care if my body drifts ashore But if you ask me, I'm pretty sure that I'll come running I should say no, 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 no Here in the ocean, nobody can hear you screaming And if I knew better, I would never need the rush and if I just think twice, I never would have had this feeling I should have said no, 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 no I've never choose to let it so the one thing that drives me absolutely insane is when my kids put stickers all over their furniture or the walls it drives me crazy i had to peel off all these stickers he was not happy when he came home and all his stickers were down because he said that it was decor for him but i just could not see these on here anymore one of the stickers it did pull up some of the paint like the wood 
and his furniture was not cheap um luckily it was only in one very small spot but i peeled up a bunch of stickers from his dresser here and then i took down he had random drawings on his wall and i took that down as well i left up his pokemon wall decals because those are meant for the walls so i'm a little more okay with that just because it is meant for the wall and it's not going to damage it but when he's like sticking you know papers and stickers on the wall it's going to peel up the paint that's where i draw the line so i took all of that down and then like i said i needed to go ahead and wipe everything down his dresser was so dusty there was fingerprints all over his mirror so i got all that cleaned up also you guys let me know how you guys like this speed i usually speed it up a little faster than this but for today's video i did slow it down just a little bit so let me know how you like this speed if you like it like this or if you like it when i do it a little more faster so in the next video i know what speed to do it at also you guys when i was cleaning this at first i was like what is all of this red stuff all in here i didn't think i was gonna be able to get it off i thought it was paint um but it wasn't it was um it was kind of like i don't even know how to explain it but he has this glue and it's i got him like a few different colors but it's like this glue that once it dries like it peels up so thankfully it was just that glue and i was able to peel it right off very easily so that is what all that red stuff is but also this little cubicle that you see here is actually not supposed to be for storage that was actually in his closet and it was a shoe organizer but he pulls it out and he's using it as like an organizer for all of his stuff so that is there but i need to get him like another one that i have on the other side where i have his books i had bought from target because this one is not very sturdy it's not meant for heavy things it's meant for light shoes he's keeping it to store a lot of his stuff so i'm just gonna leave it here for now and then once i get a new um cubicle from target then i will put this back in his closet and then put the wooden one over in this corner i just don't know if i want it as big as the other one just because i feel like it'll take up too much space so i need to see if i can find a smaller one but that is what i'm doing right now um just organizing all these like little cubicles like i said he has so much trash in here he had so much drawings that i just tossed out because it was like one or two small drawings on a piece of paper so hopefully you guys enjoy also if you guys noticed i caught up and ran in a previous clip because i heard my dog barking she was in the backyard but it sounded like she was in the front yard and i panicked and i thought that like she somehow got out and i ran but she was not she was in the backyard but her bark is just so loud it sounded like she really was in the front yard but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and finish organizing all of this
me back, pull me in, and the other way around. Pull me in, push me back. obsessed with stuffed animals my kid has so many stuffed animals that i want to get rid of some that's one thing that i'm definitely going to make him like declutter because he has two like bins plus his whole entire bed is covered and it's all he ever wants is stuffed animals we go to the store and he'll ask me for a stuffed animal for christmas his birthday he asks for them and they are just everywhere so I'm going to see if we can get rid of some but right now he has all of these that I was trying to like condense into like these little bins that I bought so like yeah I don't know <laughs> let me know does your kids love stuffed animals as much as mine I want to maybe limit it to one bin but I feel like that's going to be hard because he has like an attachment to every single one of these um so 
maybe maybe we'll figure it out but just wondering if your kids have an obsession like that as well get out of what you call home your name is written in the sky it might feel just like you're on your own but baby it's another lie remember you were me i try to work 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 but it doesn't work i try to say something but there's a word i try to just Alright, so we are now going to put up the Christmas tree. This was after I picked him up from school when I had originally was cleaning his room. It was earlier in the day while both the kids were in school and now they are obviously back home. So we are now going to put up his Christmas tree as well as the pre-lit garland. I want to see if I can find another pre-lit garland um, so I can put it over his fish tank. I think it would look really cute. I put one over his bed and then I put a garland over his dresser but that is not pre-lit. I need to find something else to attach to it, like to put on it, because it just looks so plain. It's just like a green um, one. So maybe I can find some stuff to put on there. We also didn't have ornaments for his Christmas tree. I didn't mean to think about that, but he got creative and he put some of his stuffed animals in there and it actually turned out really cute. So that is what we're doing right now. He was so excited helping me get all of this set up. The lights that we bought from Dollar Tree were pretty long. So we ended up draping over his like little cubicle next to it over that to make it look all lit up and it turned out really cute. And he, like I said, he's so excited. It's like a nightlight for him. So he keeps it on at night when he is sleeping. But anyways, guys, we're about to get to the end of today's video. So I figured while I'm already on here, I will go ahead and close it out. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, please remember to give my video a thumbs up and also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you haven't already. I would love you to be a part of my YouTube family. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for all your love and support. I say it all the time. I really do appreciate it when you guys show my channel love. When you're liking, commenting, it seriously means so much to me. So thank you from the bottom of my heart because it helps out me and my channel. Um, I think my next video might possibly be another Christmas video. I filmed me finishing up putting up Christmas decor, I don't know, a few days ago, but I have not edited it. And I also wanted to add a few more things to it because it's a really short video. All I did was like the, sh the front porch and then the main Christmas tree. So I'm gonna see if I can add some more to it before I get it uploaded. But that's another video for you guys to look out for. And then I'm also vlogging this week. So have some more content coming out for you guys very soon. So definitely look out for all of those and turn on your notification bell so you are notified when I upload. Anyways, hope you guys have an amazing rest of your morning, evening, night, whenever you're watching this. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.